comes to celebrating Christmas, it takes a village. Each year in Ark City, a business like Scott's Auto Body donates space for the North Pole and volunteers set it up. I work eight hours a day for usually about two weeks. From a dairy barn to a carousel, even a ski resort. This Christmas village has intricate details at just the right eye level for kids. So Christmas me. And who else would you expect at the North Pole than Santa himself? What's your favorite cookie? Santa will even reward you with a signed ornament if you can find all 20 stops on a scavenger hunt. What are you looking for? Betty's donut. It takes a sharp eye. Look, we found it, right there. Not only are there 360 buildings in this display, but there are 2,500 little people and cars. It's the brainchild of Canyon Ginger, who 12 years ago wanted something to bring the community together. No charge unless you want your name in front of a building for $5. We use it to help people pay utility bills that are struggling, sometimes food for families in need. Well, my first impression when I walked in here at night was everything was twinkling and it was full of kids. And I thought, this is just amazing for a small town to be able to put something like this together. He grew up in Ark City and just moved back. Others have come to the North Pole since the beginning. I get a little sentimental because having grown up in the 50s, <laughs> it brings back those memories. When you had a train set with a platform and you had your own little houses on the platform. And each year the display is different and bigger a true labor of love for the elves behind it. It's just really about being together. Young and old both, they just have so much fun and it, it touches my heart just to know that I've made their Christmas.